Hello, Aternum, and welcome to KOTT News, Aternum's number one source for news. And this is the War Report. Dynamic change in the history of Aternum last night as the Marauders of Nirvana knock out the champs and take on the title of heavyweight champions of Everfall. KOTT News crews caught up with the new champs on the steps of City Hall. Congratulations tonight on your victory in Everfall over the heavyweight champions of the Censored, spoiling their Neverfall run, beginning your own in the next fight. How do you feel about it? Care to take us through it? Uh, you know, it was a good run, Censored. You know, we had to help you out a bit, you know, throughout it, but then, you know, we decided to bench Nika, so, like, we gotta, you know, we gotta act on that. You can't be doing that, so, you know, good run. Hopefully you guys attack. Fast four. GG's. All right, excellent. Is there anybody whose efforts out there you might want to highlight? Uh, I want to highlight, uh, you know, my 18, <laughs> first time bruiser, top on the boards, easy, you know. Uh, I think that Rev, you know, he's pretty mid, but like, he did do like most of the work, so, you know, gotta give him props for that. Excellent. Well, now that you have your Hamlet, any intentions for it? Yeah. I think we'll keep it, you know, running tier five, everything. You know, we don't lose invasions like that. Since we're all invasion pros here. You know, invasion mains. We never lose invasions. Retreating to Ebon Scale for a dip in the hot springs, KOTT News crews ran into Gusto and the boys, hanging out with the union president, Bao, in his tavern. Yeah, well, pretty much we came straight out of left gate. We came hard at them. They were doing everything they could to kill us. But you know what? Role players will always prevail. Well, it looks like you're going to be celebrating all night again tonight. Is that the case? That's always the case, John. Yeah. There's never not a time where we're not celebrating here. Probably going to go RP all throughout the town, you know, the usual. Turning to the weather, and I can't believe it, but once more, the sun will burn through the sky, keeping corruption at bay all day long. But look out as the temperatures drop and magnetic confluences give rise to a 20% chance of invasion at the tips. Another lineup submitted for simulated fantasy combat resolution tonight, brought to you by LARPCO. Remember, if it isn't LARPCO, it is cardboard. Tonight, the Covenant forces of Tropical X assail the Syndicate forces of Dancing Phoenix for control of First Light and the flow of the spice. Former Great House Tropical X make their way along the coast and set up an assault camp in first light, trading the fishing from the swamp for the sands of the beach. Until recently, Dancing Phoenix has been able to maintain their monopoly on cinnamon trade routes, but with waning syndicate support, will they be able to hold their harvests? We'll have any late breaking outcomes and reactions from the citizens tonight at 11 until then, this has been War Correspondent John Chalant, KOTT News.